pretty good sized tree. It's, uh, it's leaning back towards the fence, so we're hooked on to it. Dad's gonna put a notch in it, a small one. And we're gonna try to shift it back around this way. signal. It's down. I'm sure you missed the grand finale. Uh, GoPro trouble as usual. I, I, I don't know if I'm the only one that has problems with a GoPro or not, but it's always the SD card, it says. This is the second SD card I've had, and it was working fine for a while, so now it's not, so I don't know. It makes me mad because I miss a lot of good footage. But let's go down here and take a look and see what this thing looks like real quick. pretty good cut off real good see there we put just a small I mean a small notch in the tree we don't ever put a big notch in these walnut this tree here has got some worm in it so it's gonna it's gonna hurt it a little bit but it's still a really really good tree got some height to it got a good oh, I bet it's got a good 16 foot four sided log We'll get that cut off and I think we got one or two wide oak that one there maybe one more and that wraps things up here that's uh 
Let's get out of this uh, holding went a lot easier than we thought. Pulled pretty easy. Any better. I'm gonna cut that wall over there too. Cut that wide up there too. I know a lot of you guys probably get tired of me talking about managing timber, but this is a pretty good example right here of what we try to do. Now down here in this little bowl, we, we cut, I don't know, three or four walnut, a couple white oak. But here's a good example of a tree in the future that'll really turn into something. That, that tree's got a lot of potential to really become a, a good log here in the near future. And it was kind of growing into this last big tree we cut here that we pulled, you can see there. So really, by taking that tree out and taking a couple more of these out that were taking a lot of the nutrients and sunlight from this tree, it should really put on the growth now. I mean, that, that tree's really got some height to it. So that should really help the overall health and help that tree, tree mature a lot faster in the years to come. And that's, that's something we look for. Now, I don't know that I'll ever come back to this job site and log again. Who knows? I mean, you never know that, but one thing's for sure, someday somebody probably will. So that's just something you, something you got to look at. And it's better, I mean, it's, it's good for the landowner too. I mean, the, the landowners appreciate that because down the road, they can do another harvest. This is the last tree of the job, this last little walnut. So we're going to take this thing out drop it off. That's a wrap. We're done. Let's go. job in the books finally it took a, about a day longer than it should have but I was glad to get it done and glad to get on to the next one and we're gonna head home we're actually gonna see this neighbor over here but a few walnut trees he's got try to get them bought while we're here there's two or three pretty good trees over there so we're gonna do that guys thanks a lot for watching our YouTube videos if you haven't subscribed to our channel, be sure to do that. Comment, like them, share them, whatever you want to do. I always try to get back with people and their questions the best I can. So uh, I guess we'll see you tomorrow. I'm sure we'll be doing something. I don't know what yet, but we'll be cutting and moving machines. We'll be logging. Guys, thanks a lot. We'll see you later.